Well, good morning. It's Saturday. It's breezy. Uh, Saturday, August 5th, and I'm back home. It's been a long two weeks. It's been a long time since I've been in this little scenery uh, setting, actually. That's what the professionals say, setting. But I wonder how much winding you're getting. I'm going to go into the garage. Let's go into the garage and see what we can do, because kind of, it is kind of breezy. I'm telling you. Um, let's see where I'm going to set you up. I'll put you up here. You know, this is my big honking finger. Let's take this out of the way. There, now you get the whole picture. <laughs> you don't need that. I need to get a haircut. Um, I'm hoping to lose. I know I'm going to lose some weight. I was really good this week. I really, 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 really was really good this week. Um, it was a long drive home. And. As much as I like visiting people, it's nice to be home in your own home. Although I felt like home where I was when I was with my cousin uh, Paul and Kathy, and with Lynn and Dale and Sarah, I just felt so. At, and my uncle Bob, how can I forget my uncle Bob? But uh, I felt so at home, and uh, it was just so nice. My uncle Bob went to the casino, played a penny machine, and how much do you think he won? Take a guess. I'm gonna wait. No, that wasn't. No, he won more than that. No, raise it up. Now, mind you, he was on a petting machine. Think about that. Come on. All right, do you give up? $9,644.28 on a penny machine. Oh, my gosh. I couldn't believe it. My luck, I'd, I'd lose my, all my pennies. I have no luck. So, needless to say, he took us out to dinner twice. So, so I've eaten out twice this week. Uh, one time at the Red Lobster and another time at a uh, diner dives. What is it? Diner dive in, diner drive at a dives. The the guy. What's his last name? You know who I mean. But guy, he's got the white hair, all spiked up. We went there one day too. Remember that was the day that I didn't get my fries. So hopefully it'll pay off today. So I'm gonna meet Christy at the meeting, and uh, then we're gonna come back. I told them to eat breakfast without me because I'm gonna to try to get back on my old schedule of eating what I'm gonna eat, and uh, hoping for a loss. I think I will have a loss because remember last week I had gone to eat out the day before the weigh-in and I had gained, and I didn't uh, let that sway me because I knew that it really wasn't a true gain. So I'm hoping to reflect a little bit of a loss from that week and that week. So I'm really thinking I have like a two-week weigh in. Even though I did weigh in last Saturday, I'm still considering this a two week weigh in because uh like I said that wasn't a true weigh in. The old Sandy would have let that define me. I would have went on vacation and went crazy and uh, I didn't. I was good. I really was good. But the scale will show how good I was. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go Kroger. No we're not well you know we might be doing that today because there's not very much food in the house. <laughs> well look who I found in the meeting. Alyssa. No. You're not Alyssa. Oh, Kylie. No. All right, David. No. Josh. No. Oliver. No. Sebastian. No. Who is it? Sophia. Sophia. Sophia heard that the, all the family members were having what for breakfast at my house? Pancakes and bacon. Hey, Sophia doesn't like pancakes and, wall, and bacon. I do. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. Well, anyway, um... I have to get home because everybody's, I'm not eating breakfast. I'm back to my um, normal eating habits, hopefully. But I'm so happy to report. Oh, first of all, I'll show you that we got a new sticker. Let me show it to you first. I gotta figure out, I gotta organize myself. But we got the Cherish sticker, which Sophia put on there for me. So I'm week nine. So I should be getting another charm. And I'm very happy to report that I am glad that the old Sandy didn't make an appearance this week and knew, just knew that last week that was not a true weight gain. That it was just a glitch in the system. It was just a little bit of water retention. Because this week I lost dun da 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 5.1 pounds so my total loss is 48.1 and I got a five pound sticker yay for me see 
that's what you got to remember. If you really in your heart of hearts know that it's not a true gain and you have a gain on the scale, don't let that scale define you. Don't let it be the one that tells you that you're not succeeding at what you're trying to do. Because I knew that it wasn't a true gain and I went from that step forward. I had good time. I still ate when I went out on vacation. I ate out twice. And I had what I wanted to eat both times when I went out to eat. I did not deprive myself at all. I had my snacks while everybody else was eating their strudels and their coffee cakes. And what else did they have? They had cashews. Oh, I love cashews too, but they're high fat nuts, so you can't really eat. I had a couple. I'll be honest. I did have a couple. But I would have like just like maybe six or seven, and that would be it. And it satisfied me. It was just enough. A lot of times the old Sandy would have been just enough to take another handful. But the new Sandy knew that you can't do that. You can't do that anymore. So I just had a couple. But they, they had a trifle. They had that. And what else did they have? They had donuts. They had they had lots of stuff. Lots and lots. They had chips. They had Chex Mix. They had chips and dip. The one day, though, I'll tell you, we had hamburgers for dinner. I had a knockwurst. But I had chips and dip. I did. I had a little teaspoon of dip, just enough. I counted out 10 potato chips, and I had my the my knackwurst, and I had a salad with some cottage cheese on it, and I was more than satisfied. I really was. I never felt deprived the whole week. Um, I feel good. And then last night, I went out to dinner before, when we got home, because we didn't get home till like 8.30 at night, so I had dinner last night, so I might have even had a more of a loss, but I'm happy with this. The only thing I'm bummed is I've, I've only got... 1.9 to get to 50 pounds. I was hoping to have the 50 pound award today, but I'll get it next week. I know. So let's go home because Sophia wants to watch everybody eat pancakes. No, I don't. Yes, she does. Yes, she so does. I'll see you guys in a bit. Well, guess what? Today is Sunday, August 6th. I usually don't video on Sunday, but I forgot to close up my video yesterday. So this is bonus. And there's Sophia ignoring us. Oblivious. We're on our way to Cindy's to see her new place. Say hi. Hi. Oh, so enthusiastic. Are you excited to be at Grandma's next week? She doesn't want to come to my house anymore. Yeah, I do. All righty. Let's get on a moving. Okay, I loved my vacation. I had so much fun, but it's just so nice to be back in my old chair. Relaxing. We went over to Cindy's new place today. Jim hung up a curtain rod for her so she can hang up some curtains and help David kind of organize his room a little bit, hang his pictures and stuff in his room. His room over there is bigger than the room he had here, so he's loving it. Loving every minute of it. But I miss him. I really do. Um, I stayed on plan yesterday. Um, we had, for breakfast, I had two pancakes and two strips of bacon and a cup of tea. And for lunch, I had... A piece of turkey rolled up in a piece of uh, mozzarella cheese with a glass of lemonade. And for dinner, I had a steak with a baked potato and a piece of corn on the cob and my iced tea. And today, I had a half a turkey club and a bowl of broccoli cheddar soup. Of course, I did have a chocolate malt. I know, not good, but you know what? I was craving it. I had it. going to count it in my points and move on. Tomorrow I'm going to go back to walking. I have been missing my walking. Uh, I couldn't walk at Paul's house. I was a chicken. I was a chicken little because um, in the winter, in his backyard, he had a bear. Because he lives in the country. He had a bear. We saw a lot of deer. He had a woodchuck in his backyard. And he had a coyote run across his front lawn. I don't think I want to come face to face with a coyote when I'm walking. So... I don't know that they would come up to me, but, you know, you never know. So I didn't really get a lot of walking in. When we were sightseeing, I got my walking in. When we were downtown Duluth, you know, shopping for things, I got my walking in. And I, I did well. Um, I know that the weight loss was um, a two-week loss, so that was good. I, I'm hoping to lose this week. I only got 1.9 to reach the 50-pound mark. And um, that's my next goal, to get to the 50-pound mark. And if I don't make it this week, I know for sure I'll make it next week. I, it was such a big loss, I can't anticipate that I'm going to have a, a really good loss this week. But I'm going to have a loss. Even if it's just a .1 or a .2. And you notice I didn't say only, because any loss is a good loss. 
So I'll get back tomorrow filming my food, telling you about my walking, um, back on track. No more vacation videos. I did lose some subscribers during the time I was on vacation, but um, oh well. My true faithful are still with me. I know that. And uh, it's like your friends in life. You have fair weather friends and you have real friends. And you guys that stuck with me are my real friends. Thank you so much. So um, not that I feel bad. I do feel bad that I lost people. And I do understand that they tune to me for a weight loss channel and then they see a vacation video. But as I pointed out, it's um, just memories for my family too so they can go back on the internet and see it in the future. Um, I wish I had more videos of my parents. Um, even pictures. My parent, my mother was always the one taking the movies, so I don't have any movies of my mother. My father didn't like his picture being taken. I think he thought we were going to steal his soul or something, so he never would let us take his picture. I have a few pictures from my wedding day. A couple with my, my kids, but not very many. So th that's mainly why I do this, is you know, so my kids can look back and reminisce, see what a wacky doodle mother or grandmother they had. And, uh, I make no apologies for it. If I lost people because of that, then oh well. But I'm back on track. I'm back with my weight watching and uh, my weight watching videos and letting everybody know. I'm going to spend this next week. Well, tomorrow I got laundry. I got a lot of laundry. And I got to do, I did my shopping yesterday, so I got that out of the way. But um, I got a little bit I got to do tomorrow. And then uh, catch up on my videos. I'm so far behind on my videos. But I was on vacation. Did I mention that? <laughs> I think I did. So uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.